In today's Madden 18 video, we're going to be taking a look at how you can make more Mutt Coins in Madden 18. What's up guys, my name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to today's video. If this is your first time checking out the YouTube channel, I want to ask that you do me a favor and leave a comment in this video and let me know two things. The first thing is how did you find our YouTube channel, and the second thing is what is one to two things that we could do that we could help you with in Madden 18. All right, let's hop into this video. So the topic of today's video is making more Madden Ultimate Team coins. Um, that's the way that you buy players. That's the way that you're going to basically do better in MUD. This is one of the biggest strategies. And so um, in one one basic word, here's what I'm going to tell you. Everything that I've researched on MUD, I've tried to master MUD for years, and, and it always comes down to about the same basic thing. You need to play all of your solo challenges, Okay, that's number one. And to play all your solo challenges, that's what I want us to focus on today. You need to play all of your solo challenges. And what I like to do is I like to use my solo challenges as warm-up games. And what a warm-up game is, is something that you do. You first log in, and I'll just go immediately to the solo challenges, and I will play the two daily challenges. So um, there's there's a they have this new thing this year that they're calling them the 20 days of GOAT. And basically what that means is that – you, if you win two solo challenges a day, you you get some coins, and they're doing it to feature the goat cards that they're making or whatever they're doing. But basically, what it means for you is that you can play two solo challenges every single day um, for on this on this little series. So you just go to the thing, you hit solo challenges, you scroll over, find the 20 days of goats, and that's going to give you two solo challenges every single day. And what that's done for me is it has given me. I've got. I think I've. Since I've started that, not doing anything else, not playing any other games, not doing anything, I just log on. I take about ten, I take about twenty minutes, and I play uh, a solo challenge. The solo challenges, and then I go about my time. I've made about a hundred thousand coins off of it. So that's just something little that you can do. But what the big picture is, and the big takeaway for you, is to basically come up with a strategy. Um, and they, they all have different objectives. So, so for me, like this one is I'm trying to get the computer to throw an interception. So to do that, I'm trying to give the computer as many possessions as possible so that he can throw me the interception. So to do that, I'm going to throw the ball and I'm going to go no huddle. But in a situation where you were trying to run the ball um, to conserve the clock. So, for example, if you're if you're playing a solo challenge and the object of the solo challenge is just to win the game then what I recommend you do is I'm in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook, but what I would recommend you do is to check out the single back ace and basically come out in the halfback power O out of single back ace in the Pittsburgh Steelers playbook. If you do that, what's going to happen is um, it's going to give you a one run and then your run audible down is his own week between those two running plays. It's all you need to dominate the computer in solo challenges so be sure to do that another tip is to use the gun monster formation from whatever playbook that one's in i don't even know the playbook off the top of my head but you can check that out as well but anyways guys i want to leave you with the basic takeaway that the key to making more muck coins in madden 18 is to play the solo challenges to play the solo challenges and then i want to get on defense i want to show you one other thing but before we do that, um, if you guys stay till, till the end of this video real quick, I'm, gonna, I'm going to have a blitz for you that's going to be really, really good for solo challenges as well as head-to-head. -head. But uh, for those of you guys that are new, I want to recommend and invite you to check out our Madden 18 premium membership. The premium membership, the first video should be going up tomorrow in the premium membership site. And what it is is you you pay it and you're going to get access to all of my ebooks that I'm going to be releasing this season. And you're also going to get access to a one hour weekly update video in which I dissect the scheme, how it's working, what needs to be changed, what I'm learning, every single thing you're going to get as closely to inside my mind as possible. So I would certainly re recommend checking out the premium membership. You can find that in the description. And one other thing real quick before we go. Uh, and before I show you this blitz, it's nickel three through five, and you call the play two man, cover two man. And what you do is you want to man a line, you want to press coverage, shift your D line to the left, shift your linebackers to the right, and then from there, uh, it's pretty much set up, and that's the blitz. So and it does really, really good. It's like the best coverage that you can have because it's two man under. And as you can see, you get if you don't get instant pressure, you get block shed pressure really well. So that is the blitz setup. 
And real quick for you guys, if you're looking to take your defensive game to the next level, we have ebooks for that, and we actually just put them on sale. So for this week only, they are $25. So they're 50% off this week only. So you click the link in the description, and it's going to allow you to purchase those ebooks. So be sure to check that out, and we will see you guys in about six hours with another Madden 